Coach O, big tournament last week. Lots of teams here, lots of players here, lots of matches for your team. Yeah, we had a fantastic weekend. You know, we had about 100 um, athletes here between the men and women, and our guys got a ton of matches. I think we had over 60 matches throughout the weekend. Um, you know, everybody on the team got uh, eight matches total. So that's, that's what we want in the beginning of the season, um, to get a lot of competition. Who stood out to you as being just outstanding? There were quite a few guys um, that, that stood out and did really well. Um, we had several guys that were undefeated. They went 8-0 on the weekend. Um, Luke Sanderson was 4-0 in singles and 4-0 in doubles. So he won his flight uh, in both singles and doubles. Um, Paul Hendricks did the same thing, you know, um, 4-0 in singles, 4-0 in doubles. And then uh, Jordan Azuma, a freshman, um, did the same, 4-0 in singles. Um, you know, so he, he had a great tournament. Um, but uh, a lot of guys did really well. Pat Sklenka um, had a really good win in singles over an Idaho State player. And then probably our, our biggest individual win was um, Tig and Isaac. They beat the number one team in the region um, in the first round of doubles, um, which was a fantastic win. That, that team is going to be playing in All-Americans in two weeks. And so to get a win over the best team or the highest ranked team uh, gives our guys a lot of confidence. I know it's the fall season, so you will get a lot of tennis under your belt. But how, how does this build your team as you prepare? You know, I, I think it's good for their confidence. You know, as, as a team, we, we won over 50 matches. You know, so everybody got a taste. Of um, of winning this weekend, and that's that that's really you know important for their growth. And so over the next two weeks, what we're going to do is you know take the things that we learned um, from the court and uh, apply it to practice. You know over the next two weeks before we go to our next tournament, which is uh, at the Naval Academy and at Weber State. Yeah. So in practice, do you do competition? Do you do you, do they play against each other? And I'm I'm sure your lineup not quite set yet. They absolutely do play. You know, um, tennis is is. Uh, you know, I, I think it's it's an incredibly challenging sport where it's not just about hitting balls, you know, in the court or moving. And you know, um, it's about competing and learning how to figure out um, your opponent and solving problems on the court. And so you can't do that unless you're 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 training to that. You know, so we do a lot of sets in practice. Um, you know, they are constantly competing. Whether it's you know playing a tiebreaker, we set up at the end of practice a tiebreaker and. You know, the guys are competing in front of their teammates just like it's a real dual match. So we give them that, that exposure as much as we can. All right. That's awesome. Um, more practice this week, and hopefully you get, you get plenty before Navy. Yeah, we do. We're going to send eight guys to Navy and then six guys to the Weaver State Tournament, split the squad, and, uh, you know, hope everybody has a, has a great weekend. Coach O, thanks for the time. Thank you very much, Brian.